morning teacups and welcome to vlogtober week four i'm currently standing in my very empty closet so yesterday harold and i spent the whole day packing up everything um we are not moving but we are getting new carpet today and i'm really really excited it just feels like a fresh start because we just cleared everything out and um yeah, it's gonna be really good. It's gonna feel like a new home and I truly cannot wait. So we are just waiting for the carpet people to show up. I've got my venti iced coffee with coconut milk. I've been up since 6 a.m. <laughs> so it's been a very busy week already and it's only Monday. We are now at my parents' house while the people work on the carpet and uh, my parents have decided to adopt Queenie. Well, dad decided to adopt Queenie. <laughs> he loves Queenie, so yes, he's yes. here. She loves it here. Harold, you want second drink? I've got tea, uh, lemonade. What's he thinking? Or there's, there's Cokes probably in the garage. Whatever's yeah, out there. So curious. You want tea or lemonade? Yeah, tea, tea's good. Oh, she likes, she's following him around, Abby. Mm -hmm. I know. Mm, she's, she's happy. happy. Best friend. I think she's says, oh, I can sense Abby in here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. I think so. I think she can. Yeah. It's so plushy. What do you think, buddy? Plushy sis? Oh my gosh, it feels like a different house. And now we have to put all of the furniture back, which should be fun. <laughs> what do you think? Margo! <laughs> Are you confused? So weird because it's so plushy, you know what I'm saying? I know. Like so cushiony. Yeah. Good morning, teacups. It is now the next day. I'm currently at Target and I don't know, just getting the new carpet really made me want to look at some home decor. And it is currently 38 degrees out. I do not want to get out of my car because it's so toasty in here. And it feels like winter out there. Like we had such a beautiful October. What happened? <laughs> So I found this round mirror for the family room. It's the Project 62 wall mirror with the brass finish. And then of course I have to get my cold brew, which it's on sale. Do I need another Hufflepuff pillow for my home? No, but they're 10% off, so it's going in the cart. When you're trying to film Vlogtober, but Vlogmas gets in the way, from Target and I am making some spaghetti for lunch. So this is actually vegetable spaghetti and I am starving. So I'm gonna eat this and then I'll show you guys what I picked up at Target. Okay, so at Target, of course, I got my cold brew and then I did pick up this Hufflepuff colored pillow. I already have so many of these, but 
it's okay. <laughs> well, okay, so I do have some for upstairs, but I don't have like one for, we have two couches downstairs, so I don't have one for one of the couches downstairs, so. And then, oh, I got two books. I got this one, this is the Unofficial Ultimate Harry Potter Spell Book, and this is a complete guide to every spell in the Wizarding World. I first saw this at Barnes & Noble, and then I wanted to go back and get it, and then when I went back, they didn't have it. So I saw it at Target today, and I was like, perfect. And then um, I also saw this, this is Calling All Witches, The Girls Who Left Their Mark on the Wizarding World. I had never seen this before and I think this is so cute. So let me just do a little flip through of these. So for this one, we've got all the spells. You also have the wand movements, which I think is really cool. So it just feels like a charms textbook and I love it. And then with this one, I briefly flipped through this. So let's take a look at this one. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. Look at all these illustrations. I'm so glad I got this. Of course, we've got Hermione Granger, the brightest witch of her age. This is so cool. Who else do we have? We've got Fleur, <laughs> Luna. I think Luna likes this book because she was named after one of these witches. Do you approve? And then, last but not least, I picked up a round mirror. Now this one is actually different than the one I showed you at Target. So I went with this one because it was not as expensive. <laughs> and also, it has a washed wood finish around the mirror. And I felt like that was more of like a boho look and that's more of what I'm going for, so. This is the one I went with. It's the Threshold. And here's Margo, hello. <laughs> so I'm gonna hang this up, we'll see how it goes, and hopefully it's not too small, and hopefully it's exactly how I envisioned it. <laughs> I went on Pinterest and I looked up like round mirrors above couches, and I love the way it looks, so hopefully it's how I'm picturing it. So here's the mirror, and then I'm thinking for this space, well for Christmas time I think the Christmas tree will be perfect right there, but for the time being it looks a little bit empty, so I've got this little plant and I am going to hang it from the ceiling, and I think it definitely gives off a Hufflepuff common room vibe, so I just have to get a hook to hang it up there. So my mom just called and gave me an update on Queenie, and she is doing really well, my parents are are in love with her I mean how could you not be in love with her and my dad said that they were watching Hocus Pocus last night and Queenie slept on his lap the entire time so they are best friends and I'm really glad that she's doing well so <laughs> I've still got three cats <laughs> but it is weird without Queenie so I think I'm gonna go visit her tonight because I do really miss her but I'm super glad that my dad finally has another cat because I know he really misses is his old cat Susie Q. So yeah, uh, now I'm gonna fill up my cold brew and uh, we're gonna do the unpacking, the big, big job. I actually clean out my closet pretty regularly, so I really don't have as much stuff to put back into my closet as I thought which is good because that's less work for me. And it also means that I've really narrowed down my wardrobe to pieces that I truly, truly love. And I feel like this whole experience of getting new carpet was a really good way to just go through everything we keep in our home. And it's just a lot more relaxing 
relaxing to come home to a space where there's less clutter and there's just things that, uh, well, in the words of Marie Kondo, things that spark joy. So yeah, I really don't have as much work as I thought. So this is good. <laughs> the vlog here and I wish I had some super fun Halloween footage for you guys but unfortunately I have to work at my muggle job on Halloween we are still allowed to dress up though so I am going to dress as Luna Lovegood so let me know in the comments down below what you are being for Halloween and I will see you guys again soon thanks for watching bye